Hello, it's Liu2D here, and today I'm going to show you how to make Inkbleed effect on Affinity Photo. First you want to do is open Affinity Photo, then you go to File, New, go to New here, and choose a preset. Uh, you can go for FHD 1080p, but uh, I want to go for a transparent one. To do that, go to Color, Transparent Background. Then we have our preset. To start, press T to t for text. I'll go for 200 size. 200 and go for Helvetica. And type in your text. Center it, go to alignment, align center, align middle. Then you wanna go, then you wanna go to layer, go to new light filter in here and Gaussian blur. Gaussian blur I mean. Choose your blurriness, I guess. Um, I will go for 10. You can always change that after um, go to adjustment go to curves change from master to alpha uh, top right uh, node the one you see here uh, slide to left side uh, just be careful you scroll out of the image to see how it will look like if I go almost to the left and uh, maybe not to the left but around here and you zoom it kind of look good for me but if you scroll out it kind of like being messy here it kind of look like a chunk so just be careful when you uh, slide the node I guess um, this is perfect, I guess, so I'm just going to merge it, uh, X out, go to layer again, new light filter layer, go to distort, and add some ripple effect, um, I think I like go for 10 here, no, actually 15, um, this one looks good, so merge it. Then I just like to um, uh, drag the the effects to the text, so it will kind of be a, their own folder. Uh, just uh, have the ripple first and curve adjustment in this order. Uh, if it, if it isn't in the order, it kind of yeah, you see that. Um, then I, then you have a easily an easy ink bleed effect. To add some texture, I'm just going to copy in the folder or the text. Press Control plus J. Then you will have to. So I just go to Google Chrome or to Google and uh, just find some textures you want to add. You can add anything. Um, can go for this one example. Just copy picture, copy image, whatever it is in English. Go back. Uh, Control V to paste. This is our background. And I want to add a uh, texture to the uh, text. Then you know, I, I will go for some grainy looking truck texture. Uh, this one is good. So copy image or picture, whatever in English is. And just copy paste. Just uh, drag it uh, to fit the uh, text over 
fit the pic no sorry uh fit the image or the text then i just go to from normal to lighten you see it will get the texture effect yes that's how quick and easy how i made my ink bleed effect if you don't like the uh, the effects you can always change it so you just go um, let's say it is this uh, let me just delete the old ones or the new ones i guess uh, you can just open the folder or the effect folder just uh, double click uh, and you can just change it here uh, just remember to go on alpha again from master alpha slide and node uh, gaussian blur again here so just uh, so you know just uh, double click this effects and uh, change it for your liking just uh, try and uh, yeah, just try it and see what you like